So let me start by asking, who do you main? Uh, I main Cypher, but okay. I've started to get into Omen because I saw this sweet uh, video of aggressive Omen. Okay. And... Yeah, Omen's super fun, super duper fun. But Cypher, you know, ten times more useful. Yeah. But um. Yeah. So what do you think is the reason why you aren't a higher Elo player? So like. I feel like. Yeah. What's your feedback? I feel like there's a couple things. Like I feel like I'm uh, inconsistent with my playing, okay. and I'm also a little bit hesitant. Okay. On making plays, like I'm afraid to, you know, make a play and then die and have gotcha. no use. Okay. Okay. Um. So a, a a big thing about inconsistency and people just think like, oh, it's just a bad unlucky day, right? But that, yeah. there, it's a lot more to it than that, and it's. So the plays that you're doing every day, if they're bad plays, they will be punished by good players, right? Yeah. But if you're playing against bad people, then you're going to not get punished when you do the bad play and it'll work out. Yeah. So that's where inconsistencies lie, where you're doing bad things, but it's all about how you're getting punished. Yeah. So does that make sense, right? Yeah. All right. So, let's uh, let's just get into it. Why is it so dark? Uh, I I didn't realize oh, there was okay. a really like long fade in. Okay. No. Um. There's one screen. Well, I guess we're just missing the pistol round. Not a big deal. We can. So we'll just like start from second round. Yeah. Not a big deal. Okay. So. I should have knifed him. Let's see. I bro, I should have knifed him, bro. Push your mid. Push your mid. Why are we buying here? So what's uh, so you're with the five stack? Are you guys like trying hard or like goofing around or? Uh, we goofed around for like the first couple of rounds, okay. and then I think we start trying later on. Do you usually buy second round when you lose first? Uh, no, not really. I just, it, I, it kind of just came into second nature. Like I just did it for no reason, okay. but, uh, I watched, I watched that clip and I'm like, Ooh, I shouldn't be doing that. Yeah. Okay. And, I gotcha. So, um, it's the easiest thing in the world to follow like a simple flow chart, right? If you lose yeah. first round, save second, right? Easy. Yeah. If you win first round, full buy second. Okay. Simple. Like, so if I win the first round, I will buy, like, heavy armor, specter, and all my abilities. Yeah. Because pistol round's the most important round of the game. Why? Because when you win the first round, the second round is free. Absolutely free. Because they have to save, and you can just mow them down with specters and stuff. Yeah. Okay? But the okay. only way it's free is if you have good economy and you understand why it's free. So, yeah. because like, okay, with you, with this buy here, you have heavy shields and you have ghost. Um, if you guys lose this round, which you probably will, because they have, they have, uh, they have guns, right? They have specters and stuff, and you have pistols. Yeah. So it's likely that you're gonna lose. Now, if you lose this round on the gun round, which is round three, you're supposed to be able to buy assault rifle, heavy shields, and your abilities. But oh, okay. if you buy here when you lost the first round you can't do that okay so we'll see i mean we'll just see how it plays out somebody go on the other side somebody go on the other side oh my i kind of just mess around here just looking for new trap wire spots okay. let me entry frag let me entry let me entry let me entry let me entry no let me entry let me entry why just let me do it let me do it let me go first they call me gold just let the shark is scared alright oh he did the beat hop thing we go B, we go B. He just had to me. Wow. Okay, wow, so that's good. Ropes. Good teamwork. Get the judge. No baiting. Plant, plant, plant. Love plant, that plant, trap. Plant, plant, plant. They have a fight crew. Their jet, has, their jet has a judge, by the way, so careful. Nice, nice. Yeah. Derp is pretty good, I'm sorry for On his good days. Yeah, I'll make good days. Uh -huh. No, don't, 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 don
don't push drone. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that was really poor timing. Okay. So, when, as an offensive cipher, your best tools are your smoke screen. Okay. So yeah. here, this is an automatic smoke screen every single time. Okay. You don't have to activate it right away, obviously, but always, this is 100% bread and butter, that's what you're doing oh, okay. when you're attacking, right? And the other one, you, you can save the other one, uh, you don't necessarily need to put it there because you have a trap wire, but you can even maybe put two here or something, or maybe one in heaven or something, right? But yeah. this, this must be, you must have a smoke screen there, absolutely. Okay. And yeah, I wasn't really sure on how to use okay. cyber cages as an offensive cipher. Uh huh. So. That's his mo because uh, offensive cipher, right? It's you don't have much, but yeah. If you watched Days' stream, he uses these like crazy, and he has setups and everything. Even on split, have you ever seen him do the split setup on A, where he throws no. one, he throws one here, and he throws one here, from from like right here. Yeah, it's 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 pretty nuts, and the smoke screen is like his only offensive tool to uh, use. Okay. Cause that's the difference between good and bad ciphers is how they use their smoke screens on offense. Because oh, yeah, okay. sure, everyone knows how to play cipher on defense, right? You just set up your traps and whatever. But yeah. what makes a cipher good is know how to play cipher on offense, and that's smart smoke screen usage. I think the I think. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, just a little unlucky there, but nothing too crazy. But see, like you guys lost, right? It, it was yeah. it was close, but they still had two people alive, and it's just the economy now is just screwed. Cause here, if you hit your B button, or let's see what's everyone's money at. I don't know if I press tab. Oh wait, you already bought, so let's go back to where. So... You guys... So, the, okay, the reason why it's actually, like, you guys can buy here is because you guys got the bomb down two times in a row. Yeah. So, like, so, like luckily, you were able to just barely make it over the margin of buying. But that's only yeah. possible because you got two uh, bomb... Uh, bomb plants but most of the yeah. time that won't happen and you guys will all be at like this will be like 3300 this will be like 32 35 and like this guy might be able to buy right because he's like he actually saved so yeah. and you you're forced to buy like specter and like heavy shields or something it's, it just doesn't look pretty right yeah hey, you doubted my meds no you're not a true faggot fuck you asshole <laughs> Do and it could just be that you guys were just messing around, but that you know, that's why I kind of like to uh, do VOD reviews of like ranked matches where people like there's yeah. something on the line and people try their hardest yeah. in because I don't know if you're actually uh, if this is your actual economic strategy or you're just who cares unrated you know buy whatever so it's hard yeah. to tell. I, I did another save round by the way. So I only have a pistol, so I don't expect anything right, crazy right. from last one. Whoops. See, so okay, so when you're looking here, Whoops. right? Um, this they could easily be here, right? Yeah. Are you ready to kill them? Nope. Yep. And this is just simple crosshair placement of either aiming up where they swing the top part or they swing close, right? If they do, okay. if they do, you're dead, right? Yeah. Because you are now forced to flick to them. And flicking is inconsistent and is very hard to do. Okay. So that's the uh, the power of good crosshair placement is that you don't you want to flick as little as possible. Like hold like this headshot angle and then maybe flick upwards just a little if they are swinging out. You know, so you're still gonna have to flick, but make sure your crosshair is ready when you're taking these common angles. Yeah. Yeah, watch watch sewers, watch sewers. Because the jet came through there last time. Yeah, yep, spike case. Good oh, camera? Oh. 
I used it as a bait. Oh, I see, I see. Okay. Okay. I think Sage, I think Sage. Good job. Okay, so you see how where your crosshair is? Let's see. Right? This is like knee level. Or like maybe like stomach level. Right? Yeah. So now, and since you're holding such a tight angle, you're forced to flick up and you're forced to flick to the left. So it, you, you make it so much harder for yourself. Okay? So look what happens, right? So now, because of your, your flick, you over flick. And that's, that's yeah. fine because flicking is difficult. But you shouldn't have to put yourself in a position to flick that hard. Because okay. of good crosshair placement. So that's the... I mean, you understand the good crosshair placement. I don't have to explain it to you. But I'm yeah. trying to g give you an example of the inner workings of why it's good, you know? And why it's yeah. bad. Totally. Okay, so... Because you could have probably killed this guy, right? You did 78 damage to him, and you did three shots in the chest, right? So yeah. if those, if one of the shots were a headshot, but you aim, punch him, maybe he doesn't actually kill you. So you never know. Also, when you're going up mid like that, right? Smoke screen, go here. Okay. Or smoke screen this, go here, right? Because now so like you, isolate angles. Exactly, exactly. Now you're being okay. peeked from two angles. I know you have people watching it, but if you smoke screen this, these two guys right here no longer have to watch it, and they can go into heaven with you quicker. Oh. You see what I'm saying? I never thought about it like that. Yeah. So it's it's just the easiest thing to smoke one and take the other. Okay. Doesn't matter which yeah. way you go, just smoke one and take the other. Okay. And then if they push through it, you have an audio cue. So oh, they, don't, right. they don't have to watch it because they only have to turn to it if they hear them walk through. Right? So Cypher's yeah. smoke screen is so strong. Even though it doesn't slow anymore, it's still very, very good. So, um, yeah, this, this is just, I would throw this right here and then I would barrel into heaven. All five of you guys just running into heaven, right? Easiest take ever. They can't stop yeah. you. See, but you guys are kind of like congested. You guys like are. This is super slow. Yeah, watch. watch they know you're all here now, so you guys have to explode on them. Yep, spike case. Oh. Because like right now, so they they saw you all, right? Watch. Yeah. What do you think that this Sova is communicating to his team? That they're going up to heaven. Okay. Now, what are the A players doing? They're probably rotating. Exactly. So either rotating through here, or maybe there's a big flank happening, or ropes guy might find someone. But this whole time that you make noise or they see you, your plan is revealed. So now they're all rotating to match your plan. So that's why it's a big yeah. timing thing, right? The second they see you, you have to go quick before the rotations come. You don't want to walk into a stacked bomb site because you'll lose, right? Yeah. Ooh. He destroys my trap wire by boosting his bomb. Oh, yeah. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Back up. Okay. Yeah, your Ray's watched one video and is trying to have fun now. I feel him. Wait, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I have to back up. Yep. Unlucky. You fucking destroyed my trap light, you asshole. There's one heaven. Uh, two, two heaven, two heaven, two heaven. Move, we move, we move. Sage is just sitting in the corner. Good. Of course. Look at these. Close left, up top. Oh. Scary, scary. Okay, so one thing that I always say about sage walls and uh, is that whenever you see a sage wall, always anticipate them coming out from either side of top of the sage wall. Okay. Because when they do sage wall, you don't have anything else to look at. Your crosshair shouldn't be idle because how many times do you actually see a sage or someone being boosted on the wall and then surprise you every time right yeah well sometimes right but the thing is you have nothing else to look at other than heaven and this is like you're looking up here anyway but just be ready for the fly out 
Like, yeah. it, it might seem weird to you, but every single pro pl player or higher elo player, the second this wall goes up, their crosshair is snapped at headshot level, ready for the run out. Yeah. They're either okay. looking here or they're looking for the run out, right? And same thing as mid. You know when they then they wall right here in mid? Their crosshair's not yeah. on the floor, or they're not turning around. They're looking here or here to see if they are boosted on top of the wall. All right. Okay, but see, see, remember what I said about whenever they see you, what are they calming? A A A A, right? Yeah. So what does that team? What does that tell your teammates? Rotate, rotate, right? So yeah. So all this time that's spent not taking the bomb site and not planting, you guys are congested in the in between bomb site. They are rotating behind. They are rotating to site to help, and they are coming through here. And then it's not going to be pretty. Like this shouldn't be a five v five when you attack bomb sites. It should be a five versus two max because there's only two yeah. A players, right? But when you take a site this slowly, you allow them to uh, even the numbers out. Yeah. See, look, all right, you're getting flanked from everywhere. It's just like probably all three are going to be here somewhere. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I die because I get cornered and pushed. Yeah. And what? Yeah, right here. There's one from a yep. It's just the worst position possible because yeah. and it's not because like you might be thinking, oh, if I was a better aimer, I'd kill him or if my crosshair place. But, but this has nothing to do with aim. This has nothing to do with crosshair placement. This has everything to do with you guys taking bomb sites too slowly and allowing the rotations. Because all three are here, right? You saw Omen yeah. behind, you saw Jet CT, and now Soba even even here. Right? Yeah. So either make the decisive decision to um, attack quickly, or if you find yourself attacking too slowly, fall off. Be like, all right, all right, let's let's go back. Let's go back. Let's retake mid control. Let's try to uh, work B or something. Maybe look okay. for the flanker. Cause like, imagine if all three of you guys fell off, and then went back together, killed the f flanker three v one, and then attacked B free, right? Yeah. A million times better than sitting there congested and letting yourselves get uh, closed in like that. All right, let's yeah. Go, let's go B, and you're gonna wall off. Uh... Okay, okay. So, uh, what's the, um, why, why the, the light armor here? So, okay, so you're, so now you look at the economy. So, this, this is a buy round, probably, it's, yeah, this is a buy round, everyone can kind of buy. This guy has to buy a Spectre or something. But, so what is your, looking at this and looking at this, what is in your, go going through your head? Uh, I'm not really sure. I'm pretty sure I just bought light armor and a specter so I can have an easier chance killing people. Okay. Um, yeah, that's fine. This, this is a force buy, right? So you know what a force yeah. buy is? Everyone has to buy. Okay. Yeah. Now, when you force buy, you spend every single dollar. Okay. There's no point in saving because... You're trying to win this round, and next round, if you lose, you'll probably have to save as a team anyway. So you just want to be yeah. on the same page as your teammates always. If everyone's saving, okay, you save. If everyone's buying, okay, you buy, right? But there's, you know, exceptions to half buys and stuff like that. But um, this this is a clear-cut force buy spend every single dollar you own. So here, heavy shields, heavy shields. Like, look, you leave yourself with... You can't see it, but like a thousand dollars. Yeah. Right? So, heavy shields, right? There's no point in yeah, leaving yeah. yourself with a thousand dollars, cause look, look at uh, look at your teammate. Four hundred dollars, six hundred. Yeah. So you're gonna have to save anyway next round, if you guys lose, probably. I th I think. I mean, but. Yeah, just spend all your money in okay. these situations. 
Because who knows? This this 25 armor could maybe save your life. And like, yeah, you never know. You never know. Okay. It's good. This is good. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. Nice. You see? This is what. This is perfect, right? Because the second that Sova saw you, he dies, and then he sc screams all B, right? Yeah. But look where you guys are already. So they're probably still, one's probably still like right here, one's probably still here, but you guys are already on site with a, the bomb about to be planted. This is exactly what you want to do for every bomb site, every single take. Okay. Because this is a very good timing. Oh shit. Kill that guy, perfect. Right. Easy coming. round. See, what was this? A five, this was a five V two. And look how easy it is to take the bomb site, right? Yeah. Exactly. And this is a timing thing. This is just better decision making. And this is the okay. This is the fruit of the labor, you know? Oh, I missed that. I forgot about that. Yeah, that's all right. So, you I mean, you had the right idea like here, smoke screen here, smoke screen here, right? Yeah. Best thing you can do. I'm flagging. Yeah. Just trap it all up. I would just do this exactly. Nice, nice. Now, when you have to take into account what gun you have and the angle you're peeking, right? So you have a yeah. specter, right? So this is a very far away angle for a specter, right? At maybe if you ADS and you like tap with it or something, you might be able to kill it, but most of the time, like, you're, you want to play a little safer and just wait for him to come into sight to, to play to the oh, specter's okay. advantage. Right. All if right. you have an assault rifle, I agree with this peak. Screw it. Spectre, yeah. I'm playing to my advantages, and this is not my advantage. Even though you know where he is, this is rough. And I know it's five v one, but um, in in a, like a different situation where it would be like two v two or one v one, right? Uh, this is where. Situations like this is really critical where you're playing to your gun's advantage. Okay. I'm not saying I'm not necessarily saying what did what you did here is wrong because it's five v one. Who cares? You know where he is, whatever. But I'm trying to like, you know, take this and put it to other examples. Yep. All right. So. No. Bye. 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 Please. Bye. Please. Bye. Come here, Carson. Yes. 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 Let me kiss you. Armor. Armor. <laughs> Me. Wait, did I buy armor? Oh wait, I didn't. You still have your light armor from last round, so <laughs> so hopefully you know, I, I, right? Hopefully you know the yeah. right thing to do is to upgrade your armor here. So I think it. this goes into my thing about being a bit hesitant, mm -hmm. as well as economy. Okay. I didn't so, really realize that. Yeah, yeah. Don't don't be scared to make the what you think is the wrong decision. Don't be scared to make a decision, right? Because if you let's say you just make the wrong decision okay if yeah. you don't learn from it then it's a mistake but if you make a mistake and you don't learn from it then it's actually a mistake you know but if you don't if okay. you correct yourself afterwards then it's a learning experience right yeah so like be like okay uh i don't know what to do here just choose just just hard commit to something it doesn't matter if you think it's right or wrong just okay. hard commit to something and then if it doesn't work Think about why it didn't work, right? Think about what should have been done, or how could I have made it work, or right? So, or, and if you choose the right decision and it works out, think about why it was the right decision, or be like, okay, this it was good because of this and this and that, right? Yeah. So don't be scared to make mistakes, right? Because that's how you learn. That's it's it's like limit Sova testing, you know? Test yeah. your limits. I'm pretty sure there was a miscommunication here, so I had to rotate all over the way over to B. Okay, not a big deal. Okay. See, uh, this is just you know crosshair not being ready, right? You you are constantly forcing yourself to flick uh, diagonally upwards, right? Yeah. This is a common trend. We see it all the time with you. So, uh, and. And you're probably thinking, oh, I'm just losing so many aim duels because I'm such a bad aimer or I'm just not as good as these players or just better aimers than me. But in reality, if you had your crosshair 
just a little higher and a little to the right or just ready for if you're actually ready for the bad guys then you'd probably kill them no problem no problem yeah two one right side you had oh, to make a fucking footstep paste oh he was already bottom left i need a heal i'm so good <laughs> Okay, so this position right here is uh, okay. You stand on here, right, and then you jump, toss your smoke screen this way, jump, toss your smoke screen that way, so it lands right here and it lands right here. Okay. And then you activate them both, and then you take you take one of them, right? Um, or or activate one, take the other, activate ramps and then go into site right yeah so there's there's lots of setups like that for cypher it's just doing a little uh doing a little research and a, a little custom game just throwing around that uh, smoke screen to see what's cool for, uh, and what's good okay for like beacon heaven three two one it worked it's good it's good oh, oh no like oh i'd be rushing him right now so oh, oh yeah you know because he's just ulting from sight, he can't shoot you. Yeah. Or if he's ulting here, right? This is just free. This is free, free, free. Yeah, it's a free kill. Yep, okay. Don't, don't be, uh, don't congest here. Just, just go, right? Especially if yeah. you get this kill now. Okay. So map out their defense. How many people do they play B? They play two. Okay. How many people play mid? One. Okay. How many people play A? Two. Okay. So you killed one A, right? Yeah. So now there's one A. Oh. Do you think you three can kill this one person? <laughs> we could. Easily, right? Yeah. Easily. So, but y when you think about their numbers like this, then you are a lot less frightened of the unknown. Because okay. it's not actually unknown, right? Yeah. Because you know. You know where they play. Two, two, one. Or, or sometimes one, two, two. If you know yeah. where they play, then you'd be like, okay, killed one of the A players, now there's only one left. Let's storm them and get them, right? Now yeah. they're going to be rotating for mid, so I'm going to be expecting rotator here and probably a site player. So, like, when you think, when you map it out, you get a lot less anxious about where they could be, a lot less scared, and then you can make your decisions a lot better, right? Okay. Because, like, if, if, you go, if you went back in time to you right now, after killing this person... And you know there's only one Sova ulting on A site. What would you do? I would go to A site instead. It's free. It's Sova. absolutely free. It's an idiot. I need heals. Oh. I got him! I got him! I got him! I got him! Easy, easy kill. He did it by himself. So this was that was a rotator. That was an early yep. rotate from mid, but you could have expected that. If you mapped it out, right? Yeah. And like I said, rotator's gonna be somewhere in heaven, either through CT or through ropes. But you guys are kind of pinching from ropes, so I would just be worried about this. Okay. But in reality, like either you go there and be ready for it, or you just take the site easy peasy, smoke screen heaven, smoke screen CT. If you didn't use them earlier, right? Yeah. So, free, free, free. You know, I'm like the best person. Okay. I don't look at this. Don't care. <laughs> That's funny. That's yeah. a good one. That's a good one. There's another one in the scent too. Oh, it, you you can put it inside the window near A. That's super sick. Aim lower, aim lower. Okay. Map it out. Just got a kill here, right? Yep. How many A? Two. How many mid? Uh wait, did we kill the one at mid? No. No, one. we killed B player. Yeah. And one. Now knowing this info, are you scared? Nope. Exactly. Screw this smoke. Run straight through. Throw the smoke screen through your smoke. Pop it. Go to heaven. Have him <laughs> pinch here, right? There's three yeah. of you or four of you here. I don't know. Right? Don't be congested by the smoke. Don't waste time. They're rotating. They're rotating. They're running. They're running with their knife out. And all this time you're spending, they're rotating. 
Okay. They're okay. flanking, they're rotating, they're coming, they're coming. But in reality, this is free. Free! Don't push through the smoke. The gentleman's left side. No, push through it. He says don't push through the smoke. Push through it! If you die, get the trade frag. Okay, okay, quick. Right? So there's no one even, there's no one even here! There's no one even here! The only thing stopping you is this smoke! Right? Yep. Alright, so, yeah. Smoke this a lot earlier. Screw it, pop it, run. Yeah, okay. Decisiveness. Not being scared because you understand where they play, you understand how it works, and you can map out the whole map just by using your game sense. Okay. Alright, so yeah, in we would smoke that, right, CT? Where you just tripwired? We would smoke that for yeah. sure. And then smoke somewhere, I don't know, in heaven. Yeah, okay. See, but you could have just died right here, and you have what utility? Double smoke screen and a camera. You don't want to yep. be dying as Cypher, because when you're dead, you can't activate that, and when you're dead, you can't look through that. Yeah. So you could have you could have easily died here when you could have just smoked it and then fell off, or smoked it, watched the smoke, or a million different things, but yeah, it was good. Okay. <laughs> you scared the fuck out of me. Check that out. Perfect. Uh-oh. Oh my god, there's two. There, there's two there. There's two. What are you exposed to? Uh... Wait. Oh, stairs. Right? Why can't they be here? They can, right? Yeah. The guy just called out two here, but where's the last one? You knew there was two ropes. The wall's broken. Scary. Oh. Scary, scary. <laughs> and this is this is actively mapping out where they were. Because we yeah. saw two two ropes here. So now, one of them probably fell off, and maybe one stayed, but now you know 100% sure there's two CT, and where's the other, right? So... Yeah. Okay. good. Crosshair placement, when it comes to elevations, is difficult. So, uh, yeah. I give you slack on it, right? But uh, it's something that you want to keep into account, right? Just yeah. try your best, but it's, it's, it is hard. Hard for everyone. No, he's he's outside a garage. He doesn't know I'm here. Okay, he's outside a garage. Okay. I'm so trash. Now you know. Yeah. So, um, in in a uh higher elo scenario, I would never peek this, uh, because because you know exactly where he is, right? Can yeah. he defuse from here? What? Can he defuse from here? Nope. No. So he has to walk into you, right? So there's no point in like taking these these fights because that's what the omen wants to get picks before coming into the bomb site. So uh, I know it was three versus one, right? But you really want to make sure that they are walking in and you're holding a good angle, so and you're not taking risky guys. fights. You want to All right. Oh, that's not good. I got it there. All right. So. This is good. Oh, it's over there. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. I totally think they can jump over that, but not a big deal. Move, move, move. Okay. How many RNA right now? Just one more. Just one more. Right? So go quick. Race has the right idea. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> go in. Yes! Perfect. This looks good. Why are you so good at this game? Get outside, get outside. I shouldn't be looking up into heaven. Oh, screen, screen, exactly, screen, screen, screen. right. So, um, and most of the time, like a good split looks like three this way, two here, and the bomb okay. going with the three. All right. All right. So. I need a healing. Yeah. Oh, are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Guys, somebody watch blank. Not everybody, but. Carson, somebody. we got this. There's one person. Carson, push in, pussy. I'm watching heaven. Watch screens. No one's watching screens, yeah? I would... So I'll be like, oh shit, no one's watching screens. He could already be pushed up. Smoke screen. Right? Oh, yeah. Smoke screen. Such a good such a good tool. Like, you don't even need to hold this angle, right? 
because yeah. your smoke screen would do it for you. If you if you heard him walking through, then you'd look that way. Right, just being safer, just being a little safer. There you go, there you go. You did it, but you know, way too late. Yeah. So don't be scared to waste your smoke screen. Don't be scared to waste it because then in the future you'd be like, okay, I wasted it, right? Why did I waste it? Because of this and that and this and that. Or it's like, I don't know where he is. I didn't actually waste it. Even though he didn't come this way, it's not a waste because I didn't okay. know he wasn't there, right? So just use your stuff liberally and then um, evaluate afterwards, right? Yeah. Limit test. Don't be scared to make wrong decisions. Guns. It's like, oh, just, if you're thinking, okay, should I ult this? Should I ult this? Don't even think about that. Just rip the ult and then evaluate later. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Almost. Okay. I like this. I thought he was giving me his vandal, but I realized he gave me his op. Like, oh, no. oh no! The timing. Yeah, that's fine. You eventually got him, but here, uh, I would definitely want to try and play with my teammates. I would try to like uh, run back and secure the bomb and, and play with my teammates because now, now you're like one v one, one v one, and yeah. instead of like two v oneing to someone, right? So just N -I -G -G -E yeah, there you go. So you make the right decision. I like to see that. Yep, just play with your team. Perfect. Love to see it. Love to see it. If you right, if you right click on the shock arrow once, it'll actually like. I know about to get up. No, it actually heals you. Oh, there's that over here. Okay, you spot. shouldn't oh, be entry fragging with the op. Your Silva's kind of baiting you, but not a big deal. Or was that a TP? Who knows? Okay, okay. Looks scary, right? Looks scary because yeah. there's so many different things, right? But what would make it so much less scary? My cages. Yeah, you could throw up a cage in heaven. You could throw it all the way to screens, right? Yeah. There you go. Nice. Probably should have went under heaven. You have your drone still. Hey, nice. Do some, do some, do some recon. Okay, okay. Uh, the, the camera could be ten times better, but um, check long. See. When you have the option of cutting off like a whole hallway with your smoke screen, it's a million times better than trying to like cover a whole gap with it. Yeah. And this smoke screen's not necessarily bad if it was a little deeper, so it's at the neck, right? Yeah. Go ahead, man. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. Oh. You're peeking out too much. Go. Yeah, it's just uh kind of overwhelming yourself with a bunch of yeah. different angles and a bunch of different things you have to do when you can like shut down two angles just hard hold one right okay or like what you did not wasn't necessarily bad but make sure you're safe like hide behind here or hide behind here and then check your camera again right yeah right there that's what i feel like yeah unlucky okay so buy a round no problem <laughs> Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, I literally cannot touch my keyboard after that. I think I'm cheating. Okay. Got a mid. Got a mid player. You guys ready to push B? I'm ready to push B. Lit, lit, lit. Ooh, I should have used a map there. Yeah. And now I wasted that. Look at this trick shot, look at this trick shot. Yep. Yep. That's perfectly fine, but... She's outside the garage again. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's alright, it's alright, but... No scopes only. Doing? No scopes only, Carson. Your team kind of carried this round. Why not? My boy. Okay. Everybody wall up. What the hell is this? All my boys. Oh, shit. 
I'm pretty sure we just goofed around on this last one. I got you. We just bought ops. I'm not sure if we actually win this one. I'm dead. Yeah, you see how like. Oh, oh. Well, what are you doing now? I should be focusing on the wall now. Perfect. Or on the sage, on top of the wall, exactly. rather. Exactly. Either or, either direction. But my crosshair's up here. I'm ready for this. Because what yeah. else do you have to look at? This way? You have like two teammates that way. It's fine. Yep. Or if anything, smoke it and then go. Right before this wall even comes up. You know? So. Because like, what else are you have to look at? Where else is your crosshair? What is it doing? Like nothing, right? So. Yeah. Why not just look at that in case that happens? Oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. oh I'm dead. I'm oh, dead, fuck. I'm dead. Oh, dude, I just rest me, rest me, rest me, rest me. And so, you see how slow this is a take? Yeah. From the second you guys made noise and they, the second they saw you all? Uh, flank, rotate, uh, flank here, rotate, right? So, like, yeah. you guys are getting pinched, you have no map control, so you're about to walk into a completely stacked site and maybe we one guy flanking. We should have fell off, right? And Either, yeah, 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 definitely. Oh no! Oh no. See, right? Because now you're saying, how unlucky. Oh, this omen is such a douchebag for flanking. Oh my god, what a little rat. But when we, <laughs> in reality, it's not unlucky at all. Yeah. Right? It's 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 the fact that you guys are staying in one area for so long. You're allowing this to happen to you. Yeah. So and this happens all the time with teams. They always congest here. They always congest here, and they always congest here because yeah. no one understands the timings and how important they are and what it actually means. This guy gets two kills. This guy gets two kills. Right? Yeah. I I For no reason. Oh, wait, did we win that? Yeah. yeah, we did. Alright, I love these traps. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, usually... Even though it's super telegraphed, you, you really want to have a trap like here, or like vertical, or like something yeah. in this doorway with with your smoke screens there too. Um, wait, did you buy a smoke screen this round? What'd you buy? Uh, I didn't. I just used trap wires. Oh no! Yeah. Okay, so uh, misconception of Cipher is that the trip wires are his best tool, but in reality, it's these two. Yeah. Okay. Because how good the smoke screen is it's just so good you you hear them you pop that open and if you if you hear the noise you just spam through it and then you just kill a whole team right yeah i never thought about it like that oh uh, it's just so good it's so good because um, whenever i used to use the cyber cages a lot before the nerf and then i haven't really thought about it because it doesn't slow down the enemies. it's still so good dude that 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 visual yeah. i mean that audio cue of them running through it it tells you a million things. And then you just spam. You just spam. They yeah. don't know where you are, but you know where they are. Somewhere in this skinny hallway. But you could be anywhere spamming. So that's why it's just so strong. And plus, you have $400. What's it doing for you? Nothing, right? Yeah. Rather it being a game-winning ability. Okay. A just value them a little, a little more. That's nice, nice. I can flash them. Don't be, don't be, yeah, don't don't, don't over rotate here because they're not even they're not even here on A, yeah. right? And no one's watching mid now. So like this could easily be mid to B. Because if a, a smart team was like, okay, our rush was too slow, our gig is up, let's retake the map and attack somewhere else. You guys would get screwed. Yo, if you had a nade you could be in a Yeah, I think I decided to stay. Good, good, good. I like this. We watch mid. You got your traps on B. This is good. Even good crosshair placement too. Okay. Who's gonna heal who? 
I'm thinking myself. My so now this is a good rotate. I like this. <laughs> I like the way you played this. Okay. Get your crosshair ready. I mean, okay. A little slow, but it's there. They're doing a rotation. Uh, scary, scary, right? Because <laughs> what's stopping them from being right here? Absolutely nothing. Yeah. Right? I, my crosshair is glued right here. Okay. One thousand percent. Because that's the that's the only threat, right? Yeah. They can't be heaven. They can't be anywhere else. They can't be behind you. So this is your only threat. Be ready. Have your crosshair ready. Okay. Because you don't want to flick to them. They're gonna be ramps, I think. No, they're rotating. Okay. So they're rotating. Wow. Oh nope nope nope. Not definitely not a rotate. Oh my god, the miscommunication that's going on right now, I can't... See? Yeah. Right? And I mean, like, your crosshair was 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 here and ready, but... Um... Yeah, it's more just a little unlucky than anything, really. So it's not too big of a deal. But you see what I'm saying? Like, your only threat yeah. is from here. So be ready from ramps. So be ready, be ready. Yeah, okay. Always just think about what the real threat is, and if, and keep asking yourself: Is your crosshair ready? Is it ready for a fight? What if they do peek this? Do I kill them? All right, so uh, you got to save here, right? You lost first round. Yeah. Gotta save, gotta save, gotta save. At most, maybe buy a shorty or something and like hide in the corner. There goes 15 life. Uh, they're pushing B main. Yeah, you guys are just kind of having fun here, so. Too worried about it. Okay. So that's good. That's good. Jets and vents, don't peek. You're gonna die. I need, I need health, bro. Oh, I need health, bro. Peeker, he doesn't know. Oh my there. fucking god, you self I shouldn't be peeking that. Oh, Honestly, oh yeah. god, I, got the kill. I would, god, I would probably. Cause you know she has a marshal, I would walk up, and then the second I'd hear him shoot, the second he shoots, I'm running in and killing him, or like just getting in his face with my pistol because he has a marshal, okay. right? Because you're kind of like baiting Sage super hard right here and hoping yeah. that he peeks. But if he does peek, then he'll probably be ready for you, and it's not advantageous for your gun. So. You want to get as close as you can to make his gun a disadvantage and yours good. Yeah. And just rush him. So very specific stuff. I'm not too worried about it. It was a good shot. Good crosshair placement. But why'd you get that kill so easily? Because I was ready. Because you were ready. Because you were ready at the immediate threat. Your crosshair was there. I mean, albeit a little low and you still had to flick, but you see this uh, common thing of your crosshair just being a little low and a little too close to the wall and you're always yeah. flicking this way. So yeah. just move it right and up, or left and up, right, depending on the angle. So, okay. and and you'll probably be hitting a million more headshots. Okay, so you guys won that miraculously. Bolt, asshole. Bolt. Okay. I'm gonna just kill you through a wall real quick. Yeah, you can kill Smoke screen. Okay, so when I do this setup, right, I will yeah. smoke screen here. And I'll smoke screen here. Okay. So what I what happens and uh, so if I hear anything or if they're coming, activate smoke screen, spam through it, okay? And then yeah. uh, wait for them to trigger my trap. And then if they keep pushing, then I fall back even further. S smoke screen here, and just watch it, right? Yeah. So it's like my second line of defense. Okay. I don't know why they're playing B with you. I'm not sure either. Yeah, so th that's good, right? That's where you want your smoke screen to be. Perfect. But you you really want to. Sh I want I want to stress the importance of your smoke screens. That it's this is your best tool. Next, okay. Next to this, and this is actually the third. In in rankings of how good they are. So should I think of it as like a tier list? Really? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Tier tier one, tier two, tier three. Okay. Cool. Because this will stop rushes. This does not. 
It helps, uh, but they just break it, or one guy gets triggered by it, but what about the other four? They're just yeah. running through, right? And with Jet's yeah. new update, she dashes through your trap. So oh, your traps right. are even she worse. Does do that. They're even worse now. So, smoke screen, if you hear, like... The noise, boom, boom, boom. You hear, okay, you, see, you hear three. Three in your smoke screen. So you know 100% sure they're inside here. All you have to do is spam. Okay. And you'll get kills. That's all ciphers do. My Roomba do not do any. I'm camping out. I'm camping out. Fire drone. Fire drone coming out of the Walk, 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 chop, 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 chop. I am walking, oh, asshole. Behind two of them. Sage is hit for 96 and Rain is hit behind two. Uh, a little unlucky, but... Yeah. Hey, so I don't know what the hell you're doing, but you're... But when you play Cypher, you definitely want to be close to be ready to um, take advantage of your traps and your smoke screens. Yeah. Right? Because if they trigger your traps or if they go through your smoke screens, it's only, it's only good if you can follow up on them. Yeah. Right, because you're here, they trigger all your smoke screens, trigger all your traps, they don't get punished. Okay. So you, you want to play close enough to where you can take advantage of your traps. I'm low! Oh, no. <laughs> they're A, they're A, they're A, they're A. They're both A. Nice. Good shot. Sage was A. Wait, right, how'd you die? Both A. Oh yeah, I, I didn't realize. I didn't oh, check. Oh no, the that. guy the guy on your team called both A. Yeah. Yeah, not your fault. I didn't finish the I couldn't I didn't finish the long because I'm in a bad team today. I guess I'm a player. Yeah, that's that's a lot better of a spot. A thousand percent better. Yeah, so it, it just yeah, it just seems like you're not valuing your smoke screens good enough, but I hopefully after this session that you know it's all changed. Yeah, I would definitely go into custom game and just oh, practice. Yeah. Oh yeah. Can you give me heals? Okay. Here's at the bottom. Try to find the reason why they're so good, right? Yeah. Silva's close and Sage and Reina are And like close. if you watch any Cypher streamers like uh like dazed then mm -hmm. uh you will see him using his smoke screens like crazy <laughs> what? all right follow me. i'm dead i'm dead i'm dead okay see so why don't i like this um because i'm leaving my sight wide open exactly so if they trigger these traps, what can you do? Other than call it out, right? Nothing. Yeah. The only thing you can do is say, oh, they're B, they're B, they're B, all my traps are triggered, but they're safe, right? They're still safe. They, they actually do nothing. They just yeah. they delay them for like a millisecond because they just shoot it afterwards. But they're not brick walls, right? They could just easily walk through this. Yeah. The reason why B is untakeable is because one cipher can make sure these traps and those two smoke screens can wipe a whole team. Yeah. That's why Cypher is so good in top three and in, in when it comes oh, to agents. Okay. Because he can solo hold a bomb site and wipe a whole team just by using his traps smartly. They don't know I'm here. Sewer, sewer, sewer. Fuck the jet. Oh my god, rest me. Right. No 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 They hear you, they hear you. He's one, he's one. Yes. But even sewer, here. Sewer, sewer. They don't know I'm here. Which way are you flicking? Sewer, sewer, sewer. Ooh, Up and diagonally. Two. Yep, always. Always, always, always. Are you dumb? You just gotta calibrate yourself a little. He's one, he's one. Yes, they hear you, they hear you. He's one, he's one. Yes, good. Was your crosshair ready to take this angle? Nope. Definitely not. And how many times do people wait up here to look and wait for the sewers guy to push, right? Yeah. A million percent, right? And you, 
you could take it slow. You can see, okay, this is clear. Maybe he's on the floor here. And then get your crosshair ready for that and then attack that angle. Right? Yeah. But see, what you're doing is you are peaking angles and then fixing your crosshair. When it should be fix crosshair, peak angle. Okay? Oh, okay. So just if, if you approach with that mentality every single angle, let me get my crosshair ready and then let me peak the angle. Then you will win a lot more fights. Okay. And you'll be flicking a million times less. So don't fuck. Okay, okay, okay. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm actually dead. I'm They're pushing. I'm behind them as we see. Oh, look what happened, right? Yeah. Jet just dashed through. They're pushing. Broke your tripwire. I'm Zoop. behind them as we speak. Broke. Got him. Now what? Right? Here. See, oh. now you're throwing them down. <laughs> but <laughs> these, should be, these should be down already, they right? They should be down already, okay. Exactly, right? All right. And so, like, I, I, I don't really like, I don't really like uh, this uh, trap wire right here. It doesn't do too much because the yeah. threat will always. Because what do they do when they rush B? They always go up to the site right, right? there. They don't yeah. do this. Yeah. Because heaven will just rain down on them. So they always do this. So just put your traps here, or like from on the garbage can. Or like oh, yeah. here, but or vertical, not a big deal. Yeah. Smoke screen, smoke screen. So, and if you did that, and if you were in the right position to like right standing right here to watch it, you could stop this push by yourself, even yeah. with a specter. Yeah. See, it's just it's just too late. They just walk in for free. Yeah. You gotta really lay into the enemy team why Cypher's top three agent, right? Yeah. Why he's picked every game, right? There we go. That's a start. <laughs> but see what I mean? It takes. It takes you to lose a B push for you to like to change, right? So hopefully yeah. that it just by default smoke screen, smoke screen, or you know, just use it somehow. Doesn't matter if yeah. you think it's wrong or right, just just use them and then learn yeah. later. Like, oh my smoke screen wasn't so good the last time I put it here. Let me try to change it up a little bit. Uh, I didn't really get as much use out of it, right? So, and I always yeah. ask, how much use is your traps getting? Should I change them, right? Because so far you've been doing the same traps every single time. Whenever I play Cypher, yeah. I change it every round, right? Yeah. So like one round I'll do vertical and I'll do a cross right here. Smoke screen, smoke screen. One round I'll do garbage can to floor, trap. Smoke screen here, smoke screen here. Yeah. Or like, okay. you know, or like two here or to here or you know what I mean yeah and this is you don't you definitely don't want to be peeking because yeah. what do you have as a utility to peek for you camera right yeah exactly so and what happens when cypher's dead can't use these can't use yep. this so you want to think about Cypher as like Sage, right? Sage doesn't want to die first because then she can't heal anyone. She can't use her abilities, which are very, very strong. You don't want to die first because then you can't gather info and you can't stop pushes. Okay. Very important staying alive. Here we go. We see the pattern. I just needed a weapon. Right? Yeah. Flicking diagonally up. So what does that mean? Always a little to the left of the angle or right and higher. 
Okay. Every time. So this is good, right? Because a, this is a simple fix. On every single angle, every single gunfight, all you have to do is go up and a little outwards. And okay. you're, you're, you're going to get so many more kills and you're going to be winning so many more duels because you're probably like, ah, oh, Sova's just a better aimer than me, right? <laughs> yeah. But he's not flicking and you are doing this like mini flick from top to bottom and to the little to the left. You're making it so hard on yourself for no reason, you know? Yeah. Huh? So a simple change like that can calibrate your cost there, you'll be killing people left and right. Winning a lot more duels. So I'm not too worried about this because we already talked about it, right? Because yeah. Now, now you would be watching your traps and you'd have your smoke screens down and you'd be ready. Because look, okay, you're there. Now you're running, you're going, you're going to... I'm going to drone really quick. Uh, okay, slow, slow. But I would be, you know, I'd be quick to, ready to be watching my traps. Yeah, they can't break that. Nice try, guys. <laughs> that, was, that was funny. <laughs> yeah. They try, they always try. See, imagine if you had a smoke screen there, right? Yeah. Like, obviously you still kill them all, but they're, because they're preoccupied with other things. But if you hear that noise, you just spam and you just wreck them or it stops yeah. their push. Can you res me? Can you res me? Ult that, yes, no hesitation. Oh, Perfect. Love that ult. Oh, you saved me. Holy shit. Look, you saved him. He even said, it. he's like, oh, you saved me. Holy shit. <laughs> right? That's because yeah. of your ult, right? Who cares if you think it? Oh, it's a three v two. Uh, I don't want to waste my ult because we already have the advantage on him. Screw it, use it. Because how many how many different ways can you generate ult orbs? Count them out. Ooh, yeah, by killing. Okay. Uh, by losing or winning a round. Uh, and round wins and wait. losses don't give you one. Oh, okay, and then uh, grabbing them from the map or an active player. Okay, so. There's actually, when you die, you get one too. Oh, yeah. When you plant or defuse the bomb, you get one too. And when you pick them up off the map. Four different yeah. ways to get them. So don't be scared of not doing the best and most efficient ult. Because you want to constantly be generating these four different ways of getting the ult orbs, right? Yeah. So I would have ulted that every single time, 10 out of 10 times. I'm okay. ulting 1v1. I'm ulting 4v2, right? I'm just I'm just ripping it out cuz I am not taking a chance. I am not gambling rounds. I am securing every round I can. Yeah. Okay, crosshair, crosshair. Little low and little close. Okay? Yeah. See so if he peeks this angle, you got to flick and it's got to flick up and to the right. We have spike. Oh, he's CT. We have spike. Oh, he's CT. So luckily, when you're bringing your crosshair back down, you accidentally gave yourself perfect crosshair placement, right? <laughs> so this, bad. But when, let me try and pause it at the right moment. Okay, go up. You bring it back down. Look at this. What? <laughs> Do you see? Yeah. <laughs> he walks straight into your crosshair, and all you have to do is click and you get this headshot. If you have this crosshair placement at every single angle, you would be a machine. Okay? Look yeah. how easy that kill was, right? <laughs> yeah. You accidentally had perfect crosshair placement. <laughs> That's wild. <laughs> you see what I mean, dude? I'm trying to explode your mind on how a good crosshair placement can be for you and how important it is. <laughs> so, 
So I like to tell Cypher players to think of your trip wires on a cooldown system. So yeah. a position, like wise. So let's say uh, you use this position, these things with your trip wires, okay? You use them yeah. and uh, they've been killed or they've been uh, triggered, right? So now they are on cooldown. I can no longer use this position for like two rounds or maybe three rounds. So now you change yeah. it up, okay? Okay, they find this one out, these ones over here. Okay, now those that position's on cooldown. You keep your opponents guessing all the time. Yeah. Right? You don't want to fall into this pattern where you are exploitable. So someone just walks into the site. Okay, I know where the cypher traps are. Boom, bang, kills them both. Right? Yeah. You don't want that to be ha to be happening to you. Think of it as a cooldown system. I just got locked down to the ground. Okay. Haze. Yeah, Raze is supposed to be the one rotating to help. You're the one that's holding... B is your job. This is your yeah. domain. Well. So that's good that you're staying. Uh oh, don't peek that. Scary, scary, scary. Right, so... Yeah. Like, they could easily just be right here. 100% just... Just mm -hmm. dead every time. So every time you peek this, expect someone to be there. But you don't even need to. Why? Camera. Yep. Because if you're dead, you can't open your smoke screens, and smoke screens being tier one, you want to do everything you can to utilize them well. Spikes down. Good, good, good. So this is okay to come here now because the spikes mid, and there's probably a lot more. But um, a smoke screen here would delay them long enough. For you to get back into position B. Right now, okay. there's nothing stopping them from walking through B. But if you turn on your camera and you see someone here, turn around, activate that, and then get back into position, right? Yeah. Because they don't want to walk through that. They're pushing up. Alright. Okay, crosshair, crosshair. Get it ready. Not bad. For some reason, I thought the so was did I. down. So did I. Thought, I thought that guy was dead for sure, 100%. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it, always tell whoever's playing B with you to get out. Go mid. Yeah. Go A. You don't need help. Why you don't need help? Because now you're a super smart cypher player who knows the proper way to play, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I was eating Oreo. Go, 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 go! Come on, me! Yep. No, see, you're giving them all this ground if they decide to do come through, but. But see, they can't even be here. Why can't they be here? Because. Trap, trap, right? They can't yeah. even be right here. There's no threat. So I'm walking up. Trusting my traps. Totally forgot about my traps in this yeah. moment, actually. Gotcha. Okay. So there you go. Little baitage, but you got them. Little trade. They're mid. Good, good. Yeah. Okay, so you get the call that they're mid. It was a rate. I love the I love the repositioning to make it so much safer for you. I love this. I even like this smoke. Because the, the reason also why these smokes are so good is because when you walk through them, it doesn't make a noise. Yeah. So it, it's just so good, man. It's so good. I can go on for hours talking about how good this is. <laughs> right? I would be doing something sneaky like walking through this. Right? So the trap meant nothing, right? It gave, yeah. you, it gave you a little information, sure, but... You can't follow it up. Oh I would try to stop plant right now. I'm running in. I'm running in. I'm running in. I'm running in. I'm running in I'm running in stopping the plant. Uh, right? Because look at the timer. Yeah. If you if you killed bomber, because he had to he had to stick it. Hundred percent, a million percent had to stick it. So you could just run in and get that uh, kill, and you win the round. Yeah. Because the time runs out. So that's fine. Uh. But okay. Deport. 
Dude, I'm telling you, if you fix this, this simple little algorithm you got going on about where your crosshair should be, look where you put it, right? Yeah. Dude, too close. Dude, too close and too low. Yeah. And now you see him, then you flick upwards. So, you you're gonna see some rapid improvement in your duels. Yeah. I'm excited for you. <laughs> I wish I wish I had such like a, a glaring problem that I could just like uh, easily implement to start getting these headshots better because I get out aimed <laughs> all the time. Really? Oh yeah. Cause oh yeah, I tried to use this camera. Oh my god, that was so triggering. Because I thought I could use it, but then I realized they patched it. <laughs> yeah, that's just that's just going in custom games and doing some research on the best things to do and where you can put all your stuff. It's the same thing on A too. Yeah. It's really annoying because the one on the pillar. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. You can put that one, in and you can see these greens. Oh, they fucking patched it, bitch. It's all right though. You're still. Oh, dead. <laughs> You're dead. I should have peeked my camera. Yes, and then peeked, and then pushed across. Ouch. Yeah. What? What? Crosshair just. I think I just didn't know how to spray control. With a vandal, because I mainly use the phantom. Well, this is uh, what? this is uh, it's all right, but you got aim punched. Yeah. You got shot in the head by the specter, so your crosshair like flew up. So. Oh it, yeah, I think I got tilted by the aim punch because there was a there. I think it was a game before that. The probability of getting of me getting aim punched was so high in that game. Like every headshot would just get me aim yeah. punched. Yeah. And that that comes with uh that comes with your movement. Right, because I don't yeah. know if you've watched my uh, efficient practice range video, but I, I stress the importance of stay not getting headshotted when it comes to getting headshots. They're both equally important. Headshotting someone, but you yourself not getting headshot, and that is done by proper movement and yeah. uh, proper you know crosshair placement, so you get the headshot and then you make sure. Uh, it, it, there's a lot of things, but when you get aim punched, it's really hard to win the fight. So I wouldn't beat myself up too much about it. So you see how we're kind of doing the same exact trap setup every single time? Yeah. Pretty exploitable, and you don't want to be that. Okay. So yeah, you shouldn't be you shouldn't be finding cameras mid-game. You should 100% know exactly where you want all of your cameras and what's what's possible, right? Yeah. This goes into a little time and practice into the custom game. So if you want to main cipher. You're going to have to put in the time inside custom games to find stuff like that. Okay. Find traps, find cameras. Even, dude, if you spent 30 minutes in a custom game on a single map, you'd be surprised on how much you learn. Yeah. Can you take June to carry? Okay, good. Then I'll beat him up. Oh, he's so lit now. There's a gun on my body. Okay, okay. What's the threat? What's the threat? Ramps. Ramps. Okay? Now, keep that in your mind. That the only threat right now is ramps. And now keep that in mind where your crosshair is. Oh. You see, dude? Yeah. Super dangerous. I totally missed on the other part, on the other part of ramps. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yikes. And then, and then that's a that's a kill right there, right? Yeah. You're dead. You're absolutely dead. And it's not it's not a luck thing. Absolutely. It's not unlucky. I blinded them. It's just uh, understanding what is your immediate danger and what can you be killed from. Yeah. Okay. okay. I thought he was dead. I I honestly thought he was dead. But why is he? He's on top of that box. I had to reload. Those very unlucky. Yeah. He's shut up! up there. Shut up! Yeah, tell him to shut up. Just Good. Let you know he's on ramp. And Spike was on ramp. Nice, but uh, uh yeah. Uh, Spike was on ramp. Yeah, that was that 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 sucked. And Spike was on ramp. 
Dude, if you look at the bullets, there's like two bullets that go right next to his head, like right here. Oh, that's just unlucky, honestly. <laughs> yeah. That's just unlucky. But you see what I mean? Like, uh, your your threat, your threat, right? I shouldn't be peeking that because I know no there reason. wouldn't be anybody there. Except Jet can jump up, right? But yeah, but you would hear you'd it. Hear it. So. There's no, there's no reason to even look here. Look yeah. here. Get ready for this. Maybe even peek that a little so they can't get close enough to surprise you by jumping on the box, right? Yeah. So. Spike was on oh, get the scribbles out of my screen. Okay. Okay. Oh come on. What's... Everyone's broke. Oh, everyone's broke. You have to. S oh no, you have to buy. Everyone has to buy. Because why? Overtime. Yep. Everyone has to buy. Spend all their money. Okay. Well, actually, I think we win this one. Surprisingly. Well, that's good. But uh, there's no re like you have a thousand four hundred left. Yeah. If you lose this round, it goes into overtime, and both teams get five k. Yeah. So bye bye bye, bye bye bye. Spend all your money. Right. Buy some heavy there, shields. Buy, there we go. There we go. Like this setup. Changing it up. Get that smoke screen. Get that trip right there. Looking good. Oh, nice, nice. You made a decision to buy. Bye, bye, bye. But definitely, like, uh, you want to value, you want to value heavy shields. Uh, pretty highly, right? So, yeah. Like a good buy here would be like. Actually, this is probably fine, honestly. Oh my god! Imagine! <laughs> Imagine if you're positioned for this, right? Yeah. This is the power of Cypher. Especially with this gun. You Ooh. mow them down like dogs. <laughs> oh, man. You see it? I didn't realize that. Oh you my see god. It? Oh, this is the easiest, like, 2K, probably more... Oh. So hard. Look, your traps, they're doing so much work, but they're not getting, they're not punished for triggering them. Oh, and you die. <laughs> no, <laughs> this was your highlight reel. Oh my God, I didn't fucking realize that. Dude. Oh my Lord. Like even if you guys win this round, it ain't because of you. <laughs> you could have won v five them if you played cipher properly, right? Yeah. So now we so now we know, and will be big changes, big changes. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you? Doing? All right. So that was that was good. That a lot of good stuff there that can you can immediately change and uh, really uh, shape up your gameplay. Yeah. Right, so, do you have any questions for me, or did I miss anything, or uh, anything you want no. to talk about? No, I actually, this really helped a lot. Hey, it's, I'm glad, dude. There, there's big things here, right? Yeah. And so, after you uh, fix these things, I'm, I'm going to be uploading this YouTube video, so you can rewatch it okay. in case you forget anything. 